Since I was born, I've been on this mission. Young, growing up in the hood with no purpose at first. As a teenager, I found out early on that you have to learn how to survive on your own. Not taken to the street life that was oh so familiar, but ended up learning how to use my gifts to earn some money and respect on the streets. Helped found a group named Death Squad that made a history on the street called Finkel, and we became a household name because of our showmanship. But later we run into some demons that would try to stop me from reaching my full potential. I had to separate myself, but never forgetting about my core values or my family. From living on my own since I was 16 and feeling like I lost my shield of protection when my mom passed, I had to learn life lessons through real life experience, but never shielding from what I learned from the streets and consequences of how you move. Always standing my ground when never necessary and holding myself accountable for my fuck ups. I also learned that depression will only set in if you let it. The best way to beat depression, I found out was to stay around positive, motivated people. But somehow and somewhere I got lost. Besides getting back physically, I needed to get some confirmation from some people I trust. I know this new phase is gonna take a new process to complete. One of my bros once said, sometimes you gotta put life in turtle mode to stay focused. Turtle might be slow in getting to this destination, but he always arrives at his destination regardless. From now on, all I can do is keep myself busy. And when they think I'm ready, I get a phone call. Hey, yo, Bobby, yeah. What's up, bro? Phone. Shit. Man, nigga, busy. What's good though? I think you need to take this. All right, bet. What's good, OG? How's it going in the east? Okay. You sent it. Gotcha. All right. I'll be there in a minute. For sure. It's time. One of the homies just called me and told me to meet him at the barbershop. On the way, I get a call from my homie RJ. What's good, RJ? Yo, yo, man, what up, though? I need to talk to you, man, about this event that's coming up. <laughs> All right, you funny as hell, my nigga. Hey, real quick, hey, man, did you ever finish your mission, bro? I'm still on every day, man. It's a mission. You know what it is. It don't stop unless you do, fam. All right, all right. All right, bet it up. I'm going to hit you up in a minute as soon as I make these runs. Oh, man. So let me know when you're free, man, so we can talk these details, man, so I can get you this payment. For sure. I knew that call was about some money. But let me check on my lady. See, she supports me through everything. So she got me, I got her. Hello? What's good, baby? How's your day going? My day going good. 
day it's going by great than yours. Yo, real quick, what you got on? That favorite robe that you like. Did you, did you take care of that for me? Yeah, it's already done. Did you, you know I'm hungry. Did you, did you make a little something to eat? <laughs> yes, I made it already. Just gotta hurry up and get home before it gets cold. Hey, cool. well, I got a few rounds to make before I get to the house. I'll be there in a few, okay? Okay, be safe. See you soon. After I seen my lady for some breakfast and eggs, if you know what I mean, I had to hurry to the shop to chop it up with one of the homies for some ideas on this mission. For some reason, my conscience is uneasy. I think I'm being watched now. Man, what the fuck is the deal? You good? Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, yeah. What's up, my nigga? What's up, you good? Hands oh, wet, bro. Sanitizer, my nigga. Hey, listen. You listen, got you them got clothes, you. my nigga? What? Let me tell you what I did last night. Why you trying to play tough when you soft as Casper? I put the nina to your back and destroy your ratchet. You an animated gangster. Who lines it anyways? But sunny days, I'll scoot your throat, you men mate. Six feet back and six feet deep. Let me show you how the boss had to gate in these streets. This a real blood round, so I blend it with coke. Listen, Pastor didn't want to take these notes, you understand? Mm -hmm. Okay, hey, yo, you got your clock, man. Huh? They're doing the food. Hey, 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 yo, 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 I'm hearing all that yeah, in the huh? back, man. I'm hearing all that in the back, but it's the same Detroit, man, talking about shooting Here shit up, go. man. I'm tired of hearing that, bro. See, that's what I'm talking about. My nigga. What's up, bro? Here you go. real shit, bro. Here you go. Come here, man. something. Hey. Yo. You want me to spit that one shit? That one shit, bro. You know what I'm talking about. You yeah, better check it. Borrow suit. B-O-B-B -B -B I, they see me, they think I'm T-I, triple F on you hoes, even flies fucking some felines, if you don't understand me, it's probably because you see now, I wake up dark in the morning, know my hustle walking three miles, mm. blessed to be living, don't give a fuck what they say, I'm blowing tree at the bus stop after I make my day pay, girlies, they still be flirting and waving, I stay humble, cause whenever they see me, they know I'm on my hustle, I'm in the heart of the city and only the strong survive, I am a lion walking through all of the jungle prides. Most of these niggas can't stomach the presence that I enhance. Regardless of situations, I speak my mind like a man. Do whatever I can just to stack me a couple bands. Working the nine to five in the studio making plans. Okay. Yo, some say it's taking forever, but I'm having patience. Other niggas shitting on their watches. Time wasting. Ooh, shit. Now that's what I'm talking about. That's the sauce right there. That's what hey, I'm talking about. Okay. That's, that's a blessing right there. That's the real shit I was telling y'all about, man. Just speaking real facts, man. I need to kick it with you for a minute. All right, man. I'll see y'all in a minute. What's good, OG? Chilling, man. Chilling, man. Pushing these power moves. Pushing these power moves. I want to sure. talk to you, man. Because I know things been rough with your moms and everything. Passing. And I can relate to that situation, bro. Because I've been through that been through that same pain but I see it in your eyes bro you ready you got the power you ready bro sure. and I want to give you something bro and when you get to the crib hold it down make it happen it's your time to shine my nigga all right my nigga see you in a minute bro after I leave the barber shop I get a call from another one of the big homies to meet him down at the club tonight one of the realest niggas I know to shoot the hell out of some pool too Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What's going on? Oh, I'll point you down. Yeah, I'll let you for a second. What's up, what's up? Right. Still with it, OG? Man, I'm about to waste your time, man. You know, at this point, the actions we produce have to equal our words. So, so. And we have to be consistent with our actions. So. Now that you're ready, something I want to give you. So. Only when you made it home, read the first one. Gotcha. Good looking, though, Chris. Thank you, bro. What's up, my nigga? Want something to drink? Oh, 
But he know I was drinking like that, big dog. Let me get this phone call real quick. Man. Right, man. Hello? You in the lot? All right, I'm on my way. After seeing the big homie in the club, I get a call from another one of the big homies saying he outside in the parking lot. Shit, I thought I had to pull up on him. He ended up pulling up on me. That's real nigga shit. Nigga don't even talk much, though. He a cool ass nigga. That's why I fuck with him. What's good? What's good, big dog? It is what it is to something else. The mission. Enough said, big dog. All right. Give a minute. One. Now that I got what I need, I started heading back to the lab so I could start on this mission. Had to hit the gas station first. Still think I'm being followed, though. Thinking about my conversation at the club, Big Homie was right about consistency and being a man of action. That's why it's good to have homies to get real advice yeah. from. But for some reason, I can't get over this feeling like I'm being followed. But I gotta stay alert and focused no matter what. Life teaches you about karma. So I always make sure I put out good to get back. But you never know. Get to the basement and realize that I left something that was very important. As I get back to the car, I see that same vehicle that's been following me all day. The fuck? And I don't know what's about to happen, but I'm ready for whatever. <laughs> <laughs> 